Butterflies are such beautiful and delicate little creatures, which makes butterfly images and shapes perfect for all sorts of beautiful paper crafting. That is why I love our Coordinating Butterfly Basics stamp set and the Butterflies Thinlet dies. They add that perfect touch of beauty to any card, banner, wreath, or paper crafting project. First, I want to show you the Butterfly Basics stamp set. Now this stamp set is a little different than many of our other stamp sets because there are so many different styles of art included in this one set. So we have a couple imageries, images that are solid like this fern and this flower, some line art right here of this beautiful flower that you can use blend abilities to color in. We also have three different verses as well as some background images. And of course, what's a butterfly basic stamp set without butterflies? So we have these two beautiful butterfly images right here. Now I'd like to point out this smaller uh, stamp of the butterfly actually coordinates with our bitty butterfly punch. So once you stamp and cut that out, that is what that cute little piece looks like right there. Now this is a great eclectic set that you can use to create many different styles of cards and projects. The next thing I want to talk about are the butterfly thinlet dies. Now you may notice these are a new style of thinlets as well. Here I have the actual thinlets right here and then these are the cutouts from the thinlets. Two of the three butterflies are very intricate and almost lacy looking. Aren't they beautiful? Now, you may have noticed that none of the stamps that I just showed you match these two framelets perfectly. And that is because these two shapes are meant to complement the Butterfly Basic stamp set. When you use these framelets to cut out shapes, they become a perfect accent piece to layer on top of your projects. Now this butterfly right here does perfectly match one of the stamps, the more lacy looking butterfly. And here is what that one looks like once it is stamped and cut out with the framelit. Now there can be a trick to cutting out these more lacy butterflies just because they are so intricate and they have lots of little holes in there. So uh, I want to show you a tip let me bring in my Big Shot. Now, first off, I suggest using the magnetic platform for thinlets and framelets. It just really helps them stick so they don't move around while you are cutting them. So, of course, you start with your platform, then a cutting sheet, and then I'm going to put down my cardstock. And for some, uh, big Shot machines, it helps to have a layer of wax paper in between the cardstock and the, the, the framelet, the thinlet, I'm sorry, and the thinlet. It helps the cardstock come out a little bit better and it really just creates that good crisp line of, of the cutout. So if you'd like, go ahead and put wax paper in between the cardstock and the thinlet and then top it off with the other cutting pad. And you can actually run this die through the Big Shot up to three times to make sure that you do get that good, that good deep cut. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. So there's one, two, and three, just because I really want to make sure I have a good, perfect image. So we'll take that off and remove the butterfly image and you'll see that all of those little holes they really are just falling right out just kind of have to tap it and maybe if you need to get a little piercing tool and poke out the rest of those holes but they really should just fall right out so there is that beautiful butterfly so let me show you two sample samples that I made using this stamp set and framelits here is the first. 
This one, I don't know if you can see, but we use a background image here on the back, that honeycomb looking image, and then added some of those butterflies. And I just love how these butterflies look on a card, especially the center one that's popped up a little bit more with some more little accents. It really is just a beautiful, beautiful card. And the next one is one where we have used a lot of the different stamps, really almost every stamp in that Butterfly Basic stamp set, and, and also used the Butterfly Thinlets there. And really just beautiful, those, those butterflies are breathtaking. So to enjoy these Butterfly Basic stamp set and Butterfly Thinlet dies yourself, contact your local demonstrator or visit us online at stampinup.com.